Australians favorite meat to eat is lamb and they'll eat it on any occasion. The average Australian family eats three and a half lambs a fortnight. That's the equivalent of eating a horse worth of lamb every week. They love it so much that on their national holiday, they eat it all day long. Anyone who does not is accused of being called un-Australian, which in Australian culture is worse than being called a country. During the week, Australians mostly eat chico rolls or meat pies, which are sometimes called red coffins. But on weekends though, Australians eat barbie. They rarely need to go to the butchers because most Australians still live off the land. There's plenty of fresh and aged meat on offer just the way nature intended. Once they have collected their meat, it's time to head home to burn it on the barbie. But not before they make time for a quick cleansing ale at the rubbity dub, where they can also win some more meat. Number 16, hundred dollar meat tray. Bingo! Number 18, a trailer of meat. Eureka! Bloody bonsa! Will you stop looking at me tits, Lynn? With a trailer full of meat, and a blood alcohol reading of 0.25, they head home to start the barbie. While they are waiting for the meat, yes. the lady of the house, Kabana? or Sheila, serves the entrees, Kabana? usually cabana and coon. Coon? Sorry. Building a barbie is something all Australians must learn. First, you get some bricks and put them into the shape of a square horseshoe. Once that's done, you have to find some firewood. Then, set it on fire. And finally, you need to get a grill. If you don't have one, you can just borrow one from the neighbors. And now, you're ready to start cooking. Hey, Nakas. Huh? Do you think this next might need turning? Hey, I told you I turned them an hour ago. Are your ears painted on, you bloody drongo? You guys are like a bunch of bloody Sheilas. How long before the snags are ready? Oh, about an hour or two, you girl's blouse. I think it's nearly ready. One thing you should never serve at an Aussie barbie is salad. Salad, anyone? When you're done, make sure you return the grill. And always leave your neighbor a thank you sausage. You take the lamb, then dip it in chocolate. Then you roll it in the coconut. And there you have it, the Lebington. That looks disgusting. It is disgusting. Who would like to try one?
Could you use some Vegemite? They sure do eat a lot of funny food. Ah, Tiffin! Uh, professor, uh, chop, snag, bush oyster. What is this bush oyster? Uh, it is sheep's testicles, sir. 